Okay, uh... Uh... Okay, so it has been a few days since we last recorded on this update. Hey, and we realized there's a few things we did not show you, as well as a little bit of news. As well as a little bit of news we had an announce. Uh, so let's start with uh, the oh. restaurant. Let, let's start with the Lego store. All right. Right here. Uh, this is, yeah. Oh, got my ninjas on top. Uh, this so this is, is actually accurate. I think all Lego stores are the same, but. It's pretty accurate to the one and, uh, that's closest to us. Uh, so as you can see, this is a pickup brick wall. Yeah, you got the pick a brick wall, some uh, box, some uh, shelves of some of the various sets, different sizes. You got the oversized Lego brick. It's on the wrong side, but you got to do with what you can. You got some uh, little sets down on here. Here, this can also pop off here. It's where you can get a better view of that. You got some of the various little sets, like a little UFO, a little oversized rocket, a little mini Lego man. You got the uh, buildable minifig uh, thing there. <coughs> and you got the uh, Lego store employee. Nice. Yeah. And uh, the diner. Uh, yes, and this is, let me put this back on right here. Uh, and this is my Lego diner, or uh, Joe's diner, which if anyone's seen the old classic Looney Tunes, owns a... Uh, the whole sun, the whole road signs you see in the background on sometimes uh, eat at Joe's. This is just kind of a reference to that. But, uh, it's a small, simple little diner, and the uh, back and a. Uh, this is somewhat of a modular, kind of a clever little. The back comes off, and you can get a decent view on the back side, which we'll show oh, uh, right now. And here it is. Uh, this is it's a rather small building, so it's. Pretty compressed. We got my uh, uh, chef in the background smoking, taking taking a little bit of a smoke break. Uh, we got some people eating some burgers and whatnot. We got someone coming in, and uh, this is kind of the back view of it. Once you put it back on, and so that's kind of. So how what you, is he smoking? Uh, I was I would assume a cigarette. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of worried there. <laughs> Not worried. Relieved. Relieved. Okay, so what's the next building? Uh, the next building, I guess we didn't show you, uh, was my uh, Lego dive bar. Alright, let's chew uh, it. And I guess if you can get a good angle at that, you know. Okay. So... Kind of cramped. Here, I'll move the street light. There you go. And this is my Lego dive bar, or which is just kind of one of those shady looking places. It's where I got all my uh, Lego Mafia members hanging out. Uh, and uh, I guess we'll view the inside here in a little bit. Okay. So, okay, here we go. So here's, here's the inside of my Lego dive bar, which we've got a few of uh, my Mafia members getting up a drink. Uh, we got some shady looking characters, like we got the biker in there, we got some kegs. We got uh, some wine bottles and a cash register, we got the ceiling fan and the light fixtures. I I'm actually really proud of those, those actually look pretty cool. Yeah, they do. Uh, Next. Okay, so as you can see... Here is the Ram Shack House, the Psychic Hero owns. By the way, this is kind of a promo ad for the stop motion. Anyways, so basically this guy is crazy and all, and everybody on YouTube will, will know. Yes. Uh, here's his son, he, they both live here as long as well as this dude over here. The uh, Dirty Wizard. Which, if you can try, if you can't really guess what he's doing, and uh, behind that rock in the park, he's actually prying on some children there. He's kind this of, is like the Lego version of Family Guy, American Dad, Robot Chicken, all per, put together in one piece. Yes. 
So, I think that'll do it. You guys uh, saw it. So, after this video, you know, check the other part of this. Um, and check out our new stop motion coming up. Yes. Uh, we'll put a release date someday. Yeah. Just still thinking about it. Anyways, uh, let us know what you think, and peace. Bye.